the greedy algae. Algae. Seashells. Thank you, frog. A pinch of sand. And finally, water. <laughs> My soup is ready. Want to try it? Oh, look, there's smoke. Maybe someone else is cooking here. Whoa, a volcano! What's that? <coughs> Whoa, you ate the smoke cloud. But who are you? <laughs> Bacteria! Bacteria what? Bacteria! For greedy gardens, if you like. We're very compact, microscopic to be exact, and smoke's our favorite snack. Yum, 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 Whoa! Did you see that? They ate the gray clouds and puffed them out blue. It's just like magic. Oh, it's not a magic trick. We've been doing this for a very, very long time. Before you couldn't even breathe on Earth. Before us, the Earth was like this. <coughs> Yuck! Come on, let's get out of here! <laughs> oh, the Earth is covered in gray clouds. <laughs> Why, yes, this is me when I was very young, way back when. Back then, my air was unbreathable. Oh? The gray clouds are disappearing. It's thanks to the bacteria who eat it and send fresh air to replace it. The little tiny bacteria, they'll turn it all into air? Yes, little Malabar, that they will. But it'll take quite a bit of time. I'll help them. I'll figure out the recipe for how to make fresh air to breathe. <laughs> to make fresh air, do like so. Put in gray clouds and some water with bacteria. It's not hot at all to do. You just mix it like so. And don't forget to add some bright sunlight. All right, all right, I'm coming. <laughs> Thank you, son. It's ready to eat. Bon appetit! <laughs> Here on Earth, the bacteria lived in the oceans. They made the terrible air go away and created the fresh air we breathe today. <laughs>